Hi everyone, this will be a fast and straightforward video to confirm or to debunk the myth that an Apple original charger and an Apple original cable are better than an aftermarket charger and cable. So what you see in front of you, on my left here, I have the 20 watts USB-C original Apple charger and also the USB-C to lightning original Apple cable. And in the middle, I have an aftermarket $4 charger USB-C from Amazon and also a USB-C to lightning cable from Amazon that costs $4 and on my right I have a dollar store USB-C charger and also a dollar store USB-C to lightning cable. So my video will consist in two parts. The first part is charging each phone with the respective charger and cable and see what charger and cable charges the phone from 0 to 100 the first and the second part of the video is transferring data from the iPhone to my Windows PC using each cable and comparing the speed of each cable. So let's start first with the charging test. Just before starting the charging test, I wanted to tell you about these adapters that you see in front of you. And they are all related to the dollar store charging cable. So I tried all these USB-C adapters from the dollar store. So for instance, this is 20 watts and these are 12 watts and not one of these adapters worked with the dollar store cable so what i ended up doing is that i purchased another adapter from the dollar store and i purchased also usb-a to usb-c adapter and this way i can charge the phone with the dollar store usb-c to lightning cable with the dollar store also charger but it is usb-a charger so let's start the charging now and i'm gonna put the timer here so now the charging started and this is the timer. At exactly one hour, the original charger is at 75%. The aftermarket Amazon charger is at 85% and it is clearly winning. And the dollar store charger and cable and uh, the adapter are at 30%. So at one hour and 52 minutes, the Amazon aftermarket charger and cable fully charged the iPhone SE Gen 3 and the original apple charger and cable charged the iphone to 96 percent and the dollar store charger and cable and adapter charged the iphone to 57 percent at 2 hour and 14 minutes the original iphone charger charged the iphone completely to 100 percent and the dollar store charger charged it to 68 percent so suddenly at 95 percent the dollar store charger and cable decided to stop charging i tried everything and it's not charging anymore so i'm gonna determine that the dollar store charger and cable are a fail for data transfer all three cables performed the same and they were averaging a speed between 35 megabytes per second and 32 megabytes per second while transferring a large file from my iphone to my windows 11 pc and I also tested the stability of the transfer by transferring 10 gigabytes from my iPhone to my Windows 11 PC and also all three cables were stable and they didn't give any error. As a conclusion, the best in charging were the aftermarket charger and cable from Amazon and I'm gonna leave an affiliate link for these two in the description. The next best thing was the Apple original charger and cable and the last in charging and I don't recommend it in charging was the dollar store cable and like with the USB-C chargers it couldn't charge the iPhone and with the USB-A charger and adapter it charged the iPhone but it stopped at 95% so this is discarded for the charging test now for the data transfer all three cables performed the same but because the dollar store cable couldn't charge the iPhone and it is not MFI certified I prefer to discard it so I'm not going to even consider it also for data transfer. Now, between the Apple original cable and the Amazon aftermarket cable, the Amazon aftermarket cable is a better value because it is MFI certified and also it had the same speed as the Apple original cable. So this is the recommended cable in data transfer and also the charger and the cable are the recommended ones in charging your iPhone. I hope that this video was useful to you. In case it was, please share it, subscribe to my channel, and give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. I want to thank you all for watching. I'm Eloy from Knowledge Sharing Tech. See you in the next video.